Kobe fan. Someone's got to cheer for him. <laughs> How did it feel or look having those guys back? Uh, it, I mean, they look good in their uniforms. We we were sluggish. I thought. And I thought uh, the scout team uh, took it to our defense pretty good. Uh, today we just kind of uh, we, we got a, a lot of things cleaned up. Uh, we had people running open on uh, play passes and just didn't, we just wasn't sharp. And uh, maybe I expected more. Maybe that's a normal Tuesday, but I feel like we've had a, a couple of days jump start, so I kind of thought it would be uh, a little uh, more clean. So we, we got to get some stuff cleaned up. Just from statistics, it looks like if you stop Arkansas's run game, you stop Arkansas pretty much. Is it that simple, or what? What do you think? Well, that's for sure what they they, they want to you know depend upon. Not that they can't throw it. I mean, I think that tight end is going to be a really, really special player. And the receivers have played well as of late. But, uh, I mean, you know, they, they know who they want to be. Mm -hmm. No question. I, I think it's more of a, uh, you know, them finishing drives in the red zone. Uh, if they have done that, some of these games are a little different, I, I think. And, uh, you know, they just control the, the clock so much. You know, you look at the Auburn game last week. Auburn had 21 plays in the first half. And just think, if you have a couple of turnovers and, and that's the case, and uh, you know it's it's a scary game. That's why they're such a scary team because they run it so well. But yeah, you're you're, you're I mean, that's that's what they want to be. And that also can open up some some passing lanes because you have to commit people to stop the run. Auburn only attempted nine passes. Was that more about their execution in the run game, or was there something Arkansas was doing that was allowing that? Well, you know, when I watch the game. And evaluated, I think that uh, you know, jumping out to the early lead, and uh, they didn't get that many plays to begin with. Um, uh, I think it was just a matter of controlling the game, and they were effective running it. You know, Auburn's running it really well too, so um, they did have success running the ball, and uh, you know, that shortened the game quite a bit for them. The way they handled the the lead, so. I think it, it, some of it had to do with uh, them taking care of the lead, and also they still didn't touch it as many times as you, you normally do. Is there an advantage for you guys from having just seen a team like Auburn that can be so similar to you play Arkansas? Uh, we, we've shared that in our offensive staff meetings. We feel like this is the first game this year that, you know, this, this could bite me in the butt, that I feel like I have a good idea of how they'll line up and play us. That doesn't mean we can block them and, and all of that. I mean, their, their front fours are extremely talented. They got two NFL defensive ends, and uh, 91 is a, is a special player inside. So um, I don't know that we can block them, but yes, I do think this is the first time this year I have felt like, all right, that, you know, I see how they treat something that's really, really very similar to what we do. What over the last two years you've been the head coach here, have you figured out about the difficulty of competing in the SEC West? Um, that uh, if you don't play, you will get beat. If you don't play and you don't take care of the ball, even if you play well and don't take care of the ball, we're not where we are in a position to, to win those games. Um, but uh, if, you, if you don't come out and get ready to play, uh, th this league will humble you quick. Do you realize how much of a struggle it is just to go from fifth place to fourth place? Yeah, <laughs> I, I do. It's a you know, it's a journey. I do think that uh, that we're making progress, and, and I just keep hanging my hat on that. I know that, but again, that doesn't mean that uh, progress doesn't mean in this league that you're going to jump from middle of the pack to the to the top tier right away. But we've closed the gap though. Has there been a common theme, Hugh, that you have seen in Arkansas's turnovers? We're like minus 12 in the conference. Yeah. Uh, I, I can't say that I've seen a common theme. I mean, there's some fumbles, some picks. Um, you know, some games they had that it probably skews it. I want to say the Rutgers game, they had quite a few. Um, but uh, I can't say there's a common theme. Just it, when, when it becomes problematic, sometimes it just seems like you can't get the tide turned with it.